In this video, I'll demonstrate how to use Canva to edit your product photos in bulk and get them ready for sale. With the product photos tool, you can simply upload photos of your products in bulk, select a background, and Canva will generate stunning product images in seconds. The product shots that are generated are perfect to use for your online store media, website, marketing campaigns, or anywhere else you display your products. So let's head over to Canva and go over how to instantly edit your product photos in bulk using the product photos tool. But before we get started, if you want to access all of Canva's tools and features, make sure you click the link in the video description to unlock your free trial of Canva Pro. With Canva Pro, you can access the entire Canva library of images and graphics, thousands of professional design templates, export your designs with transparency, unlock the background remover, and tons of other awesome features to help you create amazing designs. To access your free trial, make sure you head over to jasongandy.info or simply click the link in the video description. So let's start by going over how to access the product photos tool from the Canva dashboard. If you look at the menu on the left hand side, you should see a tab that says apps. Let's click that now. This will take you to a page where you can view all of the apps that are available on Canva. And if you look at the recommended tools from the menu on the left hand side, you should see one that says product photos. If we click this, we should be taken to the product photos tool. Here's where we can magically bulk edit our photos to get our products ready for sale. It says here we can simply upload photos or folders and they'll perfect the photos for us. So before using the product photos tool, the first thing you want to do is photograph your products. When taking your product photos, there's a few things that you may want to keep in mind. First, make sure you're using a good high quality HD camera. Nowadays, your smartphone should be just fine. Next, you want to make sure that you have good lighting. If you don't have studio lighting, you can simply use sunlight through a window or take your products outside. And finally, make sure you're getting good close-up shots so that the customer can see all of the details of your product. Make sure you get different angles of your product and feel free to take more photos than you need. So hopefully you've taken some photographs of your products and uploaded them to your device. Now we can add your product images to the product photos tool so we can get picture perfect product shots. To upload our images, let's look at the top here and click on the choose photos button. This will open up a new window where we can add our photos. Keep in mind that you can add up to 10 different product photos to bulk edit at a time. If you've already added your photos to Canva, you can click the select from uploads button. But since I just took my product photos and added them to my device, Let's click the Upload New Images button. I can then find all of the product images that I just took, select them all, and open them up. Your images will then be added to the Product Photos app and will be visible in the window here. As you can see, I've currently added 8 photos, but if I wanted to add 2 more to reach my maximum limit of 10 images, I could go up to the top here and click the Add More button. But for this example, I'm just going to stick with these. So let's look up at the top right and click the next button. This will take you to the next step where you can select a style and background for your photos. As you can see here, they have several e-commerce styles that you can choose from. Whether you want a nice clean white background, a 3D shadow, or your product to be showcased on a blue podium, you'll find the perfect style for your product images here. If we go back up to the top tabs, we can see that they not only have styles for e-commerce, but also for automotive designs. Feel free to try these out as well, but for this example, I'm going to stick with e-commerce. So for my product images style, I think I'm going to go with the white table. Once you select your style, you can then go up to the top right and click the apply button. And the product photos tool will then start working its magic and rendering your photos. It may take a few moments for it to complete, depending on the amount of photos that you added. But once it's finished, you'll see a link to your images appear in the product photos menu. You can see it's labeled with the style that I chose and the amount of photos that I added. If I click the link, it'll take me to a page where I can view all of my edited product photos. As you can see, the background has been removed from my images and replaced with my white table. So let's click the image here and get a closer look. Not bad. I have my meditation beads and my props sitting on the white table. The background has been cleanly removed, even around the beads and strings of my product. But keep in mind, you may take some photos where it doesn't work correctly. 
The background didn't get removed from this photo here, but that's only one out of the eight. All of the rest of my photos here actually look pretty good. There's even been a shadow added to give them a cool 3D effect. So now that you've edited your product images, you can now download them by clicking the download all button at the top here. All of your product images will then be downloaded to your device. I can now use my new product photos for the product media in my online store, marketing in ad campaigns, or anywhere else I like. Feel free to try out different styles and find the one that you like best with your products. Whether you want something plain and simple or something fancier to show off your products, you can create the perfect product images with the product photos tool. So that's a quick overview of how to edit your product photos in bulk using Canva's product photos tool. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.